hey guys welcome back to my channel today i'll be making an ariana grande baby doll dress so we're gonna start with making the circle skirt of the dress so now i'm just gonna make note of my waist and length measurements i'm gonna make a note of those measurements that i take and i'm going to calculate the, the circle skirt formula Now next we're going to draft the skirt pattern based on the measurements that I have and that I want. I will just be using a pencil or you could use a chalk and right now I'm just busy marking the radius points that I'll be connecting to and then I'm using the curve ruler just collecting connecting the radius point that is where my waist is going to be and now i'm just busy doing the length of the skirt which is going to be part of the dress and i'm just connecting the points together with the curve ruler and after that is done we'll be cutting the skirt i'm starting out with the outside part of the circle and then I'm going to do the small circle, which is going to be the waist. So that's how it looks. Excuse me. And I'm going to use that same pattern to cut another skirt pattern. So I want this bottom part of this dress to you know have more volume. Because as you can see, the fabric that I'm using and the fabric that Ariana Grande is wearing is a bit... Um, different because hers is thicker and mine is a little lighter so I'm gonna be creating more volume using the fabric that I have so it will be two full skirts on the dress I'm just gonna unpin that and now I'm going to join the two skirt patterns together so that's how they look and that's the other skirt pattern I'm gonna join them together on the sides and there I'm going to be making the bodice of the dress I'm gonna start out cutting the back side of the bodice the top um, of the dress so I'm going to be cutting four pieces for the back bodice So there will be two inside pieces and two outside pieces. So here I'll be using the patterns that I've already made for the front part of the top, which is the bodice. So I'm um, just pinning them to the fabric and that is the center front that I was cutting just there and now I'm cutting the center side pattern
so now i'm just taking all those patterns apart and i'm going to be pinning them together okay that's just the last the last um back side yeah and then i'm just going to be pairing them and pinning them and after that i'm going to take it to the sewing machine so i've already done one um set of the top bodice and i'm just going to be sewing the two pieces together once i've done sewing the pieces together i just tried it out and i saw that on the top part of the bodice it was a little bit big and uh, what i'm doing right now is making markings so i just tighten up um the the top part of the body so i'm creating dots i'm reducing um the size of the top so once i'm done with that i'm going to join the two pieces together on the top side So now I've done with that, I'm just going to be, okay, I've pressed it and um, now I'm going to be pinning the top part of the, the bodice and I'm going to be sewing on the top part across. And once I'm done with that, I'm going to take the iron and press open the seams. So it just gives it a nice finished look and the iron makes everything look neat the more you iron the more the clothes look much neater so right now i'm gonna be pinning on the part that i was stitching on after i've ironed and i'm gonna create a top stitch So earlier on, I didn't sew the sides of the skirt and now I am. And once I'm done with that, once I'm done with that, I'm going to start, okay, those are the sides. Once I'm done with that, I'm going to start making the gathers, creating the gathers on the skirt. Now I'm going to pin the bodice and the skirt and I'm going to sew these two parts together.
so I'll be sewing the bottom hem of the skirt I've pinned I'm going to be pinning um, on the bottom part of the dress and I'm going to sew to try it on a bit I'm going to add the zip afterwards um, and then after this is the final look of the dress I did alter it a bit on the top side made it tighter a bit and this is the finished product um, please subscribe like comment if there's any suggestions that you would like to make on this channel let me know bye